We've been able to uh, use the funds to help market market what Latinos Unidos is planning on doing for uh, in the community. For Catalasso, uh, this is uh, our uh, just a, almost a holiday on our calendar now uh, at our organization where uh, we're raising well over two months worth of operating uh, expenses uh, and we're able to provide over $300,000 of benefit to the community just from this one day. York Day Nursery has benefited greatly from Give Local York. Over the past few years, we were able to pay our staff over the state mandated shutdown because of Give Local York, as well as install new security cameras, get new phone system. These are all through different years. And also um, keep up with the increasing need for personal protective equipment during the coronavirus. The money that we've gotten from Give Local York has been very helpful in um, scholarship monies for children in, that have been affected by cancer. And we service over 500 patients per year, and that money has been very helpful in education and giving back to cancer patients in the community. It means that we are able to continue to hold our summer day camp for kids. Um, as you know, with COVID, uh, this year was uh, especially important for kids to be able to get together and, and join and, and be with other kids after uh, being separated so long. So we have a summer day camp for kids ages 6 to 13. And uh, normally it runs for six weeks during the summer. Uh, but uh, what our goal was this year was to make it eight weeks uh, because we felt it was so important for kids to be able to get together. Um, and so we were able to do that with the, the funds from Give Local York. Um, we, we would not have been able to do um, eight weeks uh, this year, so that was uh, that was a that was a big help for us. I would have to say, uh, especially this year uh, through COVID, uh, Give Local York uh, made a huge impact for us, in that uh, we were not able to do any of our fundraising at, uh, in events that we usually do during the year, um, but Give Local York allowed us to keep our staff in place and transition to a different type of uh, program um, uh, development as far as getting meals and uh, activities and engaging our older adults in the Spring Grove and Hanover community. So we ended up doing over 30,000 takeout meals to uh, our seniors population. And we also uh, switched over to a virtual uh, platform for our programming. So we initiated Zoom, we taught our members how to use Zoom, um, we helped them with their technology, and we provided fitness and engaging programs through the Zoom platform. And all that would not have been possible if we weren't able to keep our staff in place and transition those activities. A tangible impact. We've been able to purchase mattresses for our single room residents. We have been able to purchase welcome baskets for some of our other locations that include cleaning products and that type of thing. We have also been working on a transportation to the grocery store program at one of our elderly and disabled locations. Um, so there's, there's a lot of good things coming out of Give Local York for us. Give Local York allows us to reach more veterans in need. It allows us to help more veterans in need. The PTSD program that we're taking them for now is somewhat expensive, and we cover the lodging and transportation if necessary, too. So Give Local York this year will be everything to us to help us get through this. It's really twofold. One is it's not only about raising the funds, but it's also about the community awareness for maybe people who don't know about organizations who get to know us. We're right over here on the 400 of Market and people drive by every day. So it's also an awareness piece, but it's also creating some of that uh, fiduciary and financial support that maybe from uh, people who don't normally give to our organization to get them to know about us and allow us to do that. Well, the tangible impact for our organization is obviously the scholarship dollars that come from the many generous donors that give to us on Give Local York Day. I know for me personally, I can personally attest to this, that my involvement in the Pennsylvania Scholarship Foundation has led to me earning over $12,000 in scholarship money and cutting my student loan debt in half. So I wouldn't be able to do that without Give Local York. 
And the first thing that comes to mind for me when I think about a tangible impact of Give Local York is the engagement of our employees. So we went from a 15% employee giving annually to almost 70% of our employees contributing directly through the Give Day. Uh, that has benefits both from the perspective of certainly the dollars raised, but also just the engagement of our employees. We've long encouraged our employees to be ambassadors for our organization, but this was a really tangible way for them to act on that that then uh, created ripple effects and other uh, opportunities for engagement um, throughout the year in different efforts. And the bottom line, it was fun. It is fun for our staff and um, helps bring our mission to life in a way that without the vehicle of Give Local York, we'd have difficulty doing. Uh, the Reed Menzer Memorial Skate Park has been participating in Give Local York since its founding year, and it has been an absolute godsend to us. We're a completely volunteer organization. We have no management structure, no fundraising uh, capability, no credit card processing capability on our own. And by participating in Give Local, we get all of those tools and we can concentrate on one day to raise the money we need for the park.